Hello! Why are resin bonded fixed standard procedures with a single retainer wing better than those with two retainer wings? Initially, all dentists used two retainer wings because there was a belief that is the best thing you can do. But over the years, we realized that single retainer resin bonded fixed standard procedures behave much better and have a much better outcome than those with two retainer wings. Why is that? I think there are two explanations for it. First of all, teeth have a certain mobility. So they move within their socket about 20, 30, 40 micrometer. And that means when one is chewing, uh, loading the teeth, the teeth will show this movement in their socket and if you have two splinted abutment teeth that causes stress and that stress causes debonding. So if the mandible moves to one side, the canine for example in those uh, cases I show you on the slides here, they move to the side. Once you load the incisor, the teeth move to the anterior but the canine will not follow. And so that causes stress between those two retainer wings, which leads to debonds, and then you have a debonded retainer. And that debonded retainer cannot be cleaned anymore, and that will cause, on the long run, then decay. So when using only one retainer wing, the Batman tooth and its pontic just move together, there is not any stress in the interface of the bonding and that is one reason why we have much less uh, failures with a single retainer, resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis. Another reason for this is that of course the tactility of a button tooth with a cantilevered restoration is much higher than if you have a splinted restoration. So once a cantilevered resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis with a single retainer wing is loaded, the patient will realize, without really knowing it, not being really aware of it, that uh, there is a certain load on the abutment tooth. And then the patient might not do any overloading because that might feel a little bit uncomfortable. But when having two splinted retainer wings, the patient realizes much later that there is a certain overload and that might already be too late and then the restoration again might debond. In addition to that, using only a single retainer for a resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis is uh, causing much less harm to the tooth tissues because only one abutment tooth needs to be prepared and also you don't have to remove any undercuts in the proximal areas, so it is much less invasive as compared to a two-retainer resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis. For that reason, it is now the new standard to use only a single retainer for resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis. I hope you agree with that and use it also for your patients. So if you are a patient, ask your doctor to use only a single retainer uh, for resin bonded fixed dental prosthesis. Thanks a lot for paying attention and I hope I see you back soon.